Hi guys, it's Art, 4NMRE.com, and today we have this awesome Russian ration. This is a Russian IRPPR 24-hour alarm ration. It's also called an emergency ration. It weighs two pounds, 13 ounces, contains 2,531 calories, and has the best before date of May 22nd of 2020. And if you remember the video prior to this, Nina did the what's inside. I spared you the opening of the box and putting everything out. This is what we're not gonna use. We're not gonna use the windproof matches. We're not gonna use the stove. We're gonna use one of the teas. We're not gonna use one of the apple butters. And we're not gonna use two of the three sugars. Here's everything laid out on the tray. I went ahead and heated up the mains and this is a beef ration for sure. It has beef kasha with groats, beef kasha with rice, and beef stew, which is the stewed beef. Today we're gonna use the MRE Nation coffee mug to make our tea and we're gonna be using the world's smallest knife. This is a black tea, it's always good. With the tea, we're gonna use one package of sugar. Give that a little stir. Set this off to the side and let it steep. We're gonna open the crackers. Looks like a standard flour cracker. And we have my favorite, liver pate. Everybody knows I love this stuff. <laughs> Well, if I can't open it, I can't eat it. So that could be a big save for me. How about if we do this? I was hoping I couldn't get it open. I wouldn't have to eat it. Okay. One thing I noticed about this ration, it's an emergency ration, alarm ration, but there was no spoons or any kind of utensils. So we have to fall back to the foreignmre.com spork. We'll give the liver pate a taste. This liver pate, I have to say, is the best that I've had so far. And as you can see, I'm going back for seconds. This doesn't have a liver taste at all. It is just, man, it's, it's great. That, that's just incredible. I'm, this is my dinner for tonight. I'm probably not gonna be able to eat all of it. This is a lot of food, but I'm definitely gonna finish that pate off. It is very good, golly. And let's clean our palate with some tea in the MRE Nation mug. The tea is excellent. All right, let's try the apple butter. And look at that. I should have gave it a little bit of a knead, get the liquid out, but it's still gonna be good. Man, can't go wrong with the apple butter, apple jam. It is good. Let's start off with the beef kasha with rice. Hmm. This is just, <laughs> this is just not my day. Well, this was a ration that I guess wasn't meant to be reviewed. Problems opening up the pate, problems opening up the kasha. The, the only thing that, that opened up like it was supposed to was the stewed beef. And of course there's a lot of liquid in there and it made a big mess. So I had to take time and clean up the mess. So let's get started. We've got the beef kasha with rice and I, I heated this up earlier. So it's still warm and look at that. Immediately you can smell the, the bay leaves in here, garlic onion, probably some celery. Yeah, this is great. It, it needs some salt and pepper. And another thing I noticed that this didn't have was wet naps. When I was making my mess, I needed a wet nap to get the, the oil off my hands. Of course, it was nothing. But look at this, the groats, the beef, perfect. And now we'll move on to the kasha, beef kasha 
with the groats. Absolutely wonderful. It's got the exact same seasoning, except for it has the groats instead of the rice. And it has quite a bit of meat. Let me get another drink of the tea. Russian tea is always good. So we're gonna try the stewed beef. The translator calls it beef stew, but it's really just stewed beef. And look at that, that looks like it's gonna be very tender. This, this is great. There's no chewing involved. It's so, so soft, it just melts in your mouth. So this is a, a really good ration. Like, like I said, the only thing that's missing, some salt, some pepper, the eating utensils, and the wet naps. This is a perfect ration. The kasha with rice, I give it a 10. The kasha with groats, at another perfect 10. The stewed beef, or the beef stew, perfect 10. It's tender, it's, it's like if you threw some beef in a crock pot. Excellent. Now, the liver pate, I give this a perfect 10. No liver flavor to it. Uh, kind of tastes like a, a lunch meat. It's, it's, it's hard to describe it, but it's very, very good. And for me to say liver pate is good, you know it's good. Apple jam, apple butter, perfect 10. Crackers, these are your standard crackers, always good. Perfect 10. And then the black tea, and I added one package of sugar, a perfect 10. I'm gonna give this ration a 9.9. .9. The only reason I'm not giving it a perfect 10, it had no salt and pepper, had no wet naps, and it had no eating utensils. You can get your fresh discounted ration at foreignmre.com. And I suggest when you purchase this ration, pick you up a spork. Thanks for watching.